Hi, I'm Rob Zip, and I'm with my friends Nicole and Jessica. We are on the road to Hana in Maui, Hawaii. So join us and let's have the most epic adventures! <laughs> it's a no drone zone. So our first stop here is at the Twins Twin Falls. It's mile, mile marker two. It costs ten dollars per car to park here. Um, but that's it. <laughs> Can't wait to see these waterfalls. <laughs> here we are at the Twin Falls. There's this one and then here's the higher one. Let's see if we can get a closer look down there. So if you are adventurous, you can go to where the experienced hikers only go. I did not bring any stickers. I'm almost out of stickers, but trail to Upper Falls, be respectful. We're skipping that. We're gonna go to the, we're gonna go to the farm stand and see if we can drink, uh, drink a coconut. <laughs> they obviously have them here. Chickens run wild on this island. Everywhere. They even put them on merchandise. Hey, now we're at the Huelo Lookout. We're gonna get some breakfast, hopefully, and we're gonna look, eat it at this picnic table and look out. This beautiful scenery, holy crap. This is my breakfast. If you guess I got the kind, then you are correct. It's the banana pineapple with organic honey drizzle crepe. Um, I've let it be set for a minute because I was waiting for my friends, but look at this view. Could you imagine eating breakfast behind a prettier view? Oh my goodness, guys. That is a Pacific Ocean out there. This is outstanding. My friends, are, they're waiting for theirs. It's just a little walk down the steps here. So I guess if you're in a wheelchair maybe it'll be a little more difficult to get down to this picnic table but you can always get your food and eat it to go if you want but if you can make it down here and check out this view holy shnikes that is beautiful beautiful clear day partly cloudy excuse me but the perfect type of fluffy white clouds ah i'm you can see the coconuts hanging from the coconut tree there shaking in the wind how can you not love this? All right, let's get uh, let's get a taste of this crip. Mm. That is so. Mm. It's very sweet. The honey, organic Hawaiian honey. <laughs> this is awesome. This is Jessica's acai bowl. Look at that. Acai, right? That's how you say it. That's what she said. Acai bowl. Sometimes you just have to pull off to the side of the road and see something beautiful. And I'm not talking about my lady friends. <laughs> We were crossing the bridge and looked down and saw this waterfall. So many waterfalls. Look at this. Most people just drive past this. All right, now we're here at a state park. Why Anapanapal? I think I'm right. Why Anapal? Why Anapanapal? I I'm having a hard time. Um, you have to have reservations. Jessica said she made some reservations yesterday. So you know how I love state parks. Let's check it out. Here we are. This is the overlook at the state park. Why in a pana pana pa? If you look really hard, you can see California. <laughs> like super hard, like bending around the earth, kind of hard. 
Well, this is a small state park, um, but there is a great view here. And more importantly, there's a bathroom. There's actual bathrooms that are not porta potties. So it's important to use this when you get a chance. This is the whole park. Beautiful, beautiful uh, view. All right, so pro tip, they don't check. There's no one here to check to see if you paid a major reservation, but it's good to still support the state park system and pay your fee. That's true. So there you go. Thanks, Jessica. <laughs> to stop at the Wailua Valley State Wayside. Let's check it out. Going up the trail, apparently there's an amazing view in both directions. Yeah. Okay. Got to get this waterfall. Look at the waterfall. Look at that waterfall out there, out in the distance. That is magnificent, stupendous, extraordinary. So I've stolen some tour guide information. Apparently this area was used in Jurassic Park. I'm still like enamored with that waterfall over there i think i see a second one to the left of it so there's two waterfalls we haven't seen a whole lot of waterfalls yet i mean we've seen a few but this is cool to see them from a distance like this guys i i really appreciate you joining me and my friends on this i hope you uh, continue to join us we're still going to do a lot of stuff and i'm gonna do something special at the end um yeah let's keep going all right, there is no parking, but if you slow down, you can get some shots of this waterfall on the side of the road. Wow. Oh, this is beautiful. That's awesome. I'm excited. And they're waiting for me. All right, we're at the Pile Cut. Oh, please forgive me, I am so sorry. We're at this state wayside, and it is still part of the uh, state park which we did have reservations for um there is there's a tour group there but there's some stairs and there's a great waterfall right up here let's go check it out after the ladies come out of this nice restroom you want to wait for these restrooms when you're taking this drive um there's some porta potties and there's some places that try to make you pay to use the porta potties just wait for the uh the restrooms I'm enjoying an Aloha made Paso guava nectar. Uh, guava puree, passion fruit, and orange juice. They call it Pog from Concentrate. <sighs> Sweet nectar of the gods. Beep, 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 beep. These people paid over $200 each to be on these tour guides. So, um, if you don't want to do the drive, you can pay for one of these tour groups, but it's going to cost you over $200 each. We save like $700 by driving ourselves. So that's something to consider. There are some warning signs there. we jumping and diving. The goats can. <laughs> they look like they want to jump. Even though it does say explicitly not to do so. <laughs> They, yeah, okay. Hopefully I'm not going to videotape someone die, dying right now. The, the guy's trying to stop him. It's a, he's a, this is the tour guide. He's trying to stop him from doing it. So, But he's, he's like, whatever, dude. I'm going to do it anyway. Yep. I mean, you're not supposed to do it. But he's, he's fine. You never know what's under the, the falls, though. You know, there could be big rocks right there, you know? We're not doing it. But, yeah, he's okay. So, yeah, there's a line of, of teenagers that are doing this now. But it's fun. 
but it's fun. You gonna you gonna do it? No. <laughs> no. Absolutely not. I'm gonna go in this way. Jessica, she's got the purple top there. She's gonna walk across. She wants to get into the water. She doesn't want to jump. But she's scoping it out for us. She's scoping it out. She's yelling, pictures, 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 pictures. So you're gonna have to take still shots. Still shots of the video here. We do have, we all have wa aqua socks, uh, um, water shoes on. How cold is the water? Oh. oh, this water is so cold. Holy crap. Just my foot is in and freezing. Oh my goodness. But there's a waterfall. I'm not, I'm not getting in any more than this. This is too cold. This is way too cold. You guys could do it. Winning chocolate, Maui's first branch to bar. See the guys wrapping up the chocolates right there. You can see this spinning around where they're making the chocolate. Best chocolate, the best farm. They do grow the, they grew it here. This is a chocolate farm. <laughs> here are the cocoa, cocoa that they grow here. Oh, it's so cool. All right, here is their story. If you want to freeze out, if you want to read that, you can go to their website too, hauntedgoldmaui.com. Those are the ingredients. This is what it looks like. Let's try it. All right. Oh, look at this design on here. They make everything in this little building right here. Mm. Mm. Right. Yes. Well, I mean, that's really the hard thing about who you know. I, mm. too, I've seen a lot of different mm -hmm. things. I just saw just Chocolate I mean, Farm. Maybe it's time for Chocolate Farm. And I actually turned around to come back. I'm glad I did. Maui grown chocolate. <sighs> all right, we're all getting hangry, so we found a place that has pizza and banana bread. Let's see if it's any good. So tell me. How do you feel about pineapple on your pizza? I want to know right now in the comments. You have to let me know. So you got the white lotus, right? Is that what it was called? Without the chives. And then you got a gluten-free pizza. Pepperoni and jalapenos, fresh jalapenos. If you said pineapple belongs on pizza, <laughs> there you go. All right. They say when in Rome, right? <laughs> ah. Oh, no. Oh, that is mm. Okay, aside from uh, spilling some of the <laughs> pineapple on me, I thoroughly enjoyed that pizza. Um, so did my friend. So my friend Jessica is uh, gluten intolerant, so she said it was the best pizza she ever had. I don't know if I'd go that far with mine, but it was definitely worth stopping and getting pizza here on the Hana Trail the Hana Highway, excuse me. Um, yeah, it, it's worth stopping by without a doubt. It's a beautiful place too. Um, they're still working on it, adding some new stuff, doing some horticulture stuff. This is, yeah, stop here guys, trust me. Of course, I had to get a sticker for my car. All right guys, now we are at, part, at the uh, part of the state park that has the Black Sand Beach. Um, and they did check for your reservations um, and we were late for our reservation but they still are letting us go in for a couple of minutes and just check it out so thankfully I can bring you guys with me thank you 
here it is. This beautiful lagoon. We only have a couple of minutes, so we gotta make the best of it. Here we are on the black sand beach. Oh, it's, vol it's volcanic rock. Last time I saw Black Sand Beach was in Iceland. I can't. I just can't. I'm here. World famous Black Sand Beach of Maui. Unbelievable. There is the queen. Yes, we made it to Hana. Hope you enjoyed coming with us on the road to Hana. We're not done yet, so stick around for something very special right after this. The girls are on the beach, so it's time for me to jump in. I've got my long sleeve shirt, I got my big hat. I'm using my GoPro, so uh, we're gonna continue having this adventure. So stick around tomorrow. We're going to go to the National Park and see the volcano, so you don't want to miss that also. Alright guys, time to get in the water. <laughs> 